once you've got an online document library, you'll want to make changes to it over time. For example, to update documents, add new documents and generally to keep it organised. We'll talk about that in this video. In the WordPress admin, we've already seen earlier in the course that you have a list of all your documents. So you can very easily go to any document and you can edit it. So you click on the document. This is just the same as editing posts or pages in WordPress and you can change any of the information and then click update. And that will immediately appear on your main document library. So as soon as you click update, the changes go live in real time. If you want to replace a file, there are several ways to do that. So let's say you've revised a document and want to upload an updated version. To do that, you would click replace file and just add the new file in the usual way. So upload it. It's fairly simple. But there's another option which will actually override the original file. And if you're going to be updating documents regularly, you may wish to do that. To do that, we're going to need a free plugin called Enable Media Replace. And I'll show you how to install that now. Go to plugins, add new. And then you want to search for enable media replace. We click install. And once it's installed, activate it. Next, I'm going to go to the media library, which is the media link, and show you what that plug plugin has done. So let's say I want to um, update sample PowerPoint, whatever, doesn't matter which one. So we click on it in the media library and you'll see a new button, which is here. Replace media, upload a new file. This is added by the enable media replace plugin and it allows you to actually add a new file which will overwrite the original one. And you can do that if you want to be really careful about avoiding any version control problems, for example, and prevent people from ever accessing the original version of the document. So it's really easy to keep your document library up to date. Over time, you may wish to clean up your categories, add more tags so that people can find documents more easily. And you can do that all of your existing documents and future ones and keep it nice and organized well into the future.